Hello, I am Chef Diane DeMeo and welcome to my kitchen. Today we are making a gluten-free, Chinese-styled boiled chicken. What does that mean? It means that we are going to take a chicken, put it into a pot of water, bring it to a boil for about 10 minutes, turn off the heat, cover it, and let it sit for about one hour. And when it's done, take it out and we're going to have the most tender, juiciest chicken ever. And we're going to have a sauce that has gluten-free soy sauce, scallion, cilantro, and a little bit of ginger to dip that bad boy in, plus to boot, a little bit of chicken consomme. How do we make this? Well, I'm gonna show you, and let's get cooking. I have my chicken. You can use any type of chicken you like. I do all natural. This is about maybe a two to three pound chicken. In my pot it goes. I already have some water in there. Now on top of that, I am going to add some fat spice. Not too much. I'd say about one tablespoon of fat spice. I like me some star anise. So I'm gonna go in with one, bow, and a little onion for flavor, not too much. Put that in, oh, about a quarter of an onion. Some garlic. Now if you had some lemongrass, you can go ahead and use lemongrass with that also. If you want to use some like Asian basil, which is also very good, you can put it in. We're just gonna do it this way, garlic, smash, Four. And I've got about, I'd have to say, one gallon of water in with my chicken. And some ginger. Peel it. Get those nubs off. Bye bye. Bye bye. Bye bye. Let's cut it into some pieces. And I always like to smash things, not because I'm violent, but because smashing gives me not only a sense of well being, but it also kind of gets the juices and the oils out and allows it to infuse into the water more. That set, I'm gonna add just a tad bit of salt, not too much, and that is all. I'm gonna get on the stove, get on the high boil, 10 minutes, turn off the heat, cover it, and we're gonna be ready for chicken. While the chicken is on the stove, getting ready to go for a big boil, we're gonna make our gluten-free dipping sauce. I have here some organic gluten-free soy sauce, which is less sodium. It's like a tamari. And we're going to go in about with, okay, bucket bucket, eh, half a cup. Okay, now here comes the fun part. I like to have a little flavor of onion, but I don't like to have the onion inside of it. So I take a little microplaner or a grater, whatever you want to call it, and I, without getting my knuckles, get a little onion juice in there. And I do the same thing for garlic. Love the flavor, we don't want it too strong. So maybe just a little bit of garlic. That looks like it's about enough. Next, we wanna do the same thing for some ginger, but I like the flavor of ginger in this, so I'm gonna do a little bit more than just a smidgen. And here we go. Get some nice garlic, onion, ginger in here. You can use this basically with anything. You could make this for dumplings, or you can add this for a little bit of um, stir fry. You could add this to your rice on top. Anything. All right, so got my scallions. We're gonna give that a nice little chop, add it in there. I say the more scallions, the better. All right, that's about enough. That's about a half a cup, and it goes. And next, cilantro. Now, a lot of people think that cilantro is like for Latin flavors, but cilantro can be used in Asian cooking because a lot of Asians use cilantro. There's different types. So I've got about a quarter cup here as well. In it goes. And guess what? That's it. That's the sauce. Let it infuse for a little while. Maybe 10 minutes, maybe 20 minutes. Oh my God, it smells so good. Okay, that's ready to go. And now all we have to do is wait for our chicken and soon we'll be having a delicious boiled chicken with some yummy scallion cilantro ginger sauce. It's been about one hour. The chicken's been sitting, steeping in the hot water and I'm ready to take it out so we can try it. Hold up, here we go. <laughs> Yes, sir. All right. 
So I'm gonna fish out that chicken. Come on, baby. There it is. And while it's sitting there, I'm going to get some of this broth ready for me too, like a consomme right in that little bowl there. Mmm, it smells like a chicken pho. And let's give this some accoutrement. There we go. A little bit of cilantro. And a little bit of basi. And just a little squeeze. Pinche of salt. Now, for the part that we've been waiting for. Delicious chicken. Oh, oh, oh look at that. Look at it. I oh, look at it. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Right. Oh my gosh, so good. So let's get some of that chicken on that plate. We're just gonna do a little bit like that for now. Okay, maybe a little more, because I am a little greedy. There you go, just like that. Now, we're going to wait for it. It's almost this delicious, gluten-free, scallion ginger cilantro sauce. Right on there, like that. A little drizzle. Yeah, baby. Boiled chicken in an Asian broth with a ginger scallion cilantro sauce. A little bit of consomme with all the accoutrements. So I'm ready to taste this, but we're gonna taste it two different ways, right? We're gonna steal a little piece from here, and I'm gonna do what they call a dunk a dunk. Dunk a dunk. Mm hmm. Uh huh. Okay. Yeah. Okay. And now for the real prize. Going in for the kill. In, in we go. Huh? Lots of touchdown dance. So good. So tender. So juicy. The dipping sauce gives it extra added flavor. And this I'm going to eat and I will say goodbye to you now. And I'll see you next week with another super tasty dish. Ciao. Hello, I'm Chef Diane DeMeo and welcome to my kitchen. Today we are making homemade fresh burrata.